from WXOW, this is Lacrosse's own News 19 Daybreak. The inaugural Ho Chunk Founders Day powwow will come to the Lacrosse Center on Saturday, March 30th. It's free and it's open to all. And joining us this morning with a little more on the powwow, we have Clayton and Rosalind here. Good morning, folks. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, thanks for being here and, and talking about uh, this upcoming powwow, which traditionally wasn't from the Ho Chunk people. It, it was adopted by the Ho Chunk people. Can you kind of fill us in how the powwow came to be adopted, Clayton? One of my um stories that I heard throughout my few years that I've been on this earth, but um, one of them was the, the Ho-Chunk Nation was a large um, tribe way back when. And there was a gentleman out, out uh, west back when tribes were fighting amongst themselves. And this gentleman was wondering how he could uh, settle the tribes down, the nations down. So. He uh, sent this drum to the east, west, north, south. When it came this way, the Chippewas were um, the ones that received it out here, and in turn, they passed it down to the Ho-Chunk people. So we, the people look at POWs as being tra traditional, but that wasn't really a part of us. But over the years, we did adapt to it in the 1800s and to present, so it's it's, people say traditional but it's really not so it's an, it's not a, a tradition of the ho-chunk people but it's now used as what a symbol of, of gathering of bringing people together making friends new friends uh, me me meeting old friends and uh, what really brought that drum to us uh, one of the things that um, during world war one world war two vietnam different wars like that that um, this this drum there's a lot of family songs that are are re referred to um, when our um, veterans were overseas and when they came home and so we have honor songs not for families and for individuals that served in the armed forces so yeah, very powerful what a great way to honor honor people who you know paid the ultimate sacrifice or were willing to give it all for 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 your people and for all of us here so, so what are some of the activities that we can look forward to at this powwow, Rosalind? Um, there'll be singing, dancing. Uh, there will be some contest specials. Um, I believe day pay for some of the younger ones. And we'll also be having some food vendors and craft arts and craft vendors as well. Grand entries, one starts at noon, one yep. starts at seven o'clock. Yes. It's gonna be an action-packed day. I know a lot of people are looking forward to this one. So Rosalind, Clayton, I really appreciate you both taking some time to chat with me this morning. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. I'd also like to give a shout out to the Lacrosse Center for opening up their doors for us. Yes. yes. So thank you. Absolutely, well thanks again for joining us folks.